hello today well tonight really <laughs> um i don't know why i keep saying that I always do this perhaps it's my catchphrase um um we're going to talk about um generations you know we'll talk about our generation my father my mother's generation you know it's i know i've covered the subject of decades before but we're going to cover it but we're going to expand it um okay as i said before my childhood memories was the 80s um the early 80s it started like, with um toys um toy what toys do you remember um, like we used to collect the car like matchbox cars hot wheel cars um lego um great times um BMX bikes, I had a BMX bike and music wasn't a big thing for me in the 80s um, that kicked off for me in the 90s really the music time but we're not going to talk about that at the moment we're going to talk about um, so the 80s just like a kid like when you was a kid growing up <coughs> excuse me I didn't do none of well of course we all burp but yes, that's another subject anyway um yeah um what else is there to say then it grew up to the computers you know my, my parents bought me my um amstrad cpc 464 amazing you know it was good it was good back then um yes i'm having a drink as usual you know the music and uh, yeah the music didn't kick off to me, um, as I say. But then I, like, when I was growing up, when I was a kid, you know, mother and my dad, they was into their music, like the fifties and the sixties. Um, you know, I didn't appreciate it back then, but now I do appreciate, you know, their generation. I do. I mean. Especially the 60s, I thought, at least they had talent, you know, they had talent. And that's more what you can say for today with this um, engineered, pop engineered shit that they got now. All they can do, they can just sing, that's it. Okay, you do have your bands nowadays, yeah, which is good. But nowadays it's just pop crap. Um, and after shit that I listen to today, and especially when I'm at work and I listen to Kiss FM, what utter shit. Come on, where is the talent? There's no talent. Um, you say, I can, I, I, and then I can look back at my, like my parents' generation. At least I can safely say there was talent. There was none of this pop engineered shit that you get today. Um, okay, the fifties. That's like right, my bad, my dad's um, favourite um, generation. I think it was the fifties. Um, okay, I can't really get into it, but I can appreciate it. But they had to, you know, you had to have talent. It wasn't all about looks. And what that, what it is these days? Oh, you could look in. Oh, you can be a singer. Can't fucking sing, but they enhance the voice, you know, you can tweak it, you can do anything these days, can't you? But at least back then, you had talent. Um, but, yeah, I can safely say, music is shit nowadays. But that's not what I'm here to talk about. Um, okay, I'll talk about it a little bit, but yeah, but what I'm talking about is generations really <laughs> see then I can look back at my grand or well, I can't because I can't remember my granddad's generation though because you know it's all pre second world war stuff I'd, I, I would suppose because you know I was too young at the time to appreciate what they listened to I, I was well too young um, it would have been nice, you know, it, was, it would have been nice to hear what they had to say about their generation, you know. Unfortunately, my grand, my, my um, 
Nana Miranda, or my dad, so unfortunately I didn't know my mother's side because they passed away before I was born. Um, but it, I would have appreciated um, what they went through. Um, I know they went through two world wars, but I know I, it couldn't have been nice. No, it couldn't have been. My, na my granddad, he was in the Royal Navy. You know, fought proud for his country. I should say you know but I oh, wish I could have you know understood more but but I can, I can understand now which we didn't when we was kids and you can fully appreciate what you know your parents their generation was like and I bet it was a damn sight better than what it is now okay you didn't have the technology you know that's what we we grew up on was technology um, the computers like from the the 80s well we made maybe the late 70s um, well the 70s is where it all started from well I know it started from the 60s but you're talking about home computer when the micro computer just say when the micro machine micro computer that micro chip was invented you know, when the microchip was invented, that revolutionised everything. And we're still using the microchip today. Um, even though it was developed in the 70s, we're still using it today. Okay, it's vastly, vastly, vastly improved. You know, like everything does. Everything improves in life. But will there be a replacement for the microchip? Oh, I reckon there will. You know, I mean, the microchip... It's been around, so as I say, since the 70s. So, there's got to be a new technology um, around the corner somewhere. Um, it's like with everything, everything advances. Um, <coughs> well, that one will always burp. <laughs> oh my god, well, my, my camera keeps going funny. Yeah, but I, the thing is, I'm 40, you know, it's, so obviously I know I've got a, a lot of audience now, a lot younger than me, but the thing is, they would not understand, I think, this, maybe they would, maybe they would, because you know, the young, so their parents would have been around the 70s and 80s mark probably so yeah so yeah, might because I grew up you know, I, I remember listening to my dad's music playing their 60s, 50s and 60s like my mother used to play like, I think it was more of the 60s the 70s so really I did uh, grew up I grew up with that and all because you know my dad that's a musician, musician, no, I can't fucking say it, musician, no, you know, nothing big or nothing like that, but he, so I know, like, he loves his music, he's really, really does love his music, and when I was growing up, I, I knew that, um, he plays the guitar, sings, so, Unfortunately, that didn't rub off on me. I don't know why. I, I do have a bit of musical interest. I try and make music, but electronically. But I can't fucking sing to save my life. Um, but music to me, I like making music. I enjoy it, but, you know, it's not on a keyboard. I can't play the fucking keyboard, even though I don't. I do own one. <laughs> I can't fucking play any instruments at all. My dad can play the guitar. I do own a guitar, but I can't fucking play it. <laughs> um, yeah, but it's amazing. It's amazing. Uh, it's a shame it, 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 it didn't... Um, you know, my dad's um, passion for music didn't rub off on me in that way. It, it should have done, but... I don't know, I just... I'm more into electronic, like keyboards, and I do like the sound of the guitar. I wish I could play the guitar, but 
I wish I could play the keyboard. <laughs> um, but I don't know, it's just more samples and stuff like that I'll try and mix about with. Um, but I just, I just wish I could. I wish I could. Maybe I should have done some more with music. I wish I could. Yeah, but I think I think it's an interesting subject. Um, what are your thoughts on it? If you want to, you do a VR, or it's up to you. Um, uh, just leave comments if you want. That's that's fine. Um, but what? Um, do you remember about your parents and you know their music when you was growing up? It's like, what was their generation of music? Do you remember it? Um, as I say, to me, I grew up with my. With, well, obviously, I fucking of course I grew up with my mum and dad, but I, I just remember them, the times that, you know, we wasn't, we wasn't wealthy, nothing like that. But I just remember certain times we all went fun. We couldn't get, afford to go to a, a, abroad. We just went or caravan on it. We had a caravan, like a little caravan. I had a Cortina, just put the uh, caravan to the back of the Cortina and we just went to Hastings or something like that. Went to a caravan site, you know, that were good times. Great times that were. Um, I, had, I did have a happy childhood memory. It was a good childhood I had. You say, we couldn't afford the best of things, but we made do with what we had. That was good times. That's how I got into gaming. You know, they went to hey we went to Hastings and set, you know, put the caravan, she used to walk down there, go to the seafront, it was arcades, I used to go in the arcades. Uh, it was great. I had a Kentucky fried chicken, I brought that back to the caravan, watched the telly on our little weenie little black and white telly. <laughs> Brilliant. It was brilliant. I really loved those days when I was a kid. You know, it was great. Fantastic. You know, what was your memories of that like when you was a kid? I, mean, I, I could say my memories were great. Great memories. Great times. Brilliant. Anyway, I'm going to end this review. Uh, I almost said it again. Review. <laughs> what we're fucking reviewing nothing at the moment. I'm going to end this video. That's the way I'm going to say it. <laughs> and thank you for watching. Till next time. Goodbye.